hello guys so in this tutorial I'm gonna show you how you can set up a local host server to test your website and so let's get started if I go to my computer local SD I have a WAMP server 1.7.4 alright so link to it I'll be providing in my in my description so double click it and you can there in the last option previous one you can select your preferred language option over here click next choose the destination folder and it shows the space required and the space available go next installing Apache in my SQL are um, like necessary because if you want to use PHP or something then they are needed and FileZilla, I don't know about FileZilla class. I didn't ever use it. And click in, click on install. So I guess it's gonna take some time. So I'm pausing the video and I'm gonna like resume it on the very last chip. All right. So as you can see, we're towards the last chip. All right. Wait for some time like 30 seconds or something I guess less than it alright our uh, processing is done it says to wait if I'm not wrong after this another dialog box gonna open like this checking necessary ports it will check the available ports to run your local host it found an error in mine and so it repaired it alright see here you can see everything alright so if I wanna in, uh, run control panel now alright so yes here you can see a control panel go to admin here you can see local select your preferred language my English alright so your local host has been um, set up so your URL for what like with which URL you wanna go I'm gonna go with this proceed anyway alright where it is where it is here we are having many information like PHP info it shows the version of PHP which is supported by XM and my PHP admin as you know we worked in uh, my PHP admin and created many databases in our last tutorial like users and stuff for other things you could also create database and there are some pre-made databases alright so if you go over here you can see databases these both of them cannot be deleted and I don't know about others but I guess they're one of the main one alright so how do we put um, some files into it so if you remember in our PHP we created a login script let's copy it from here to my computer I install it and see Sam htdocs so this is the folder to which we are redirected and so we get XAMP in our link if you remember over here we went to localhost see XAMP the folder is in this so paste it over here if you remember remember this name login go over here login see here it is you can also create a or what do we call another folder called project or something project project and you can move into this so if you go to project projects all right here's the index our project called login um, 
uh, if you remember we in last classes we used this these both are one of the same things they don't have any difference basically but this one is used for MySQL thing like to connect it to our database so prefer this one rather than localhost thing alright so this is how you can set up a basic localhost and to reopen that control panel will look like this it's already running over here you can see click it running just charge this file okay install install service or start service start server all right you can see that this is like installed um, as you can see our service has been installed you can go to service and if you untick this then you're like uninstalling everything all right click apache Fossila and okay all right there running your game you can refresh see there's chatus see you can see services chart threads and ports they're using actually well, right now the HTT HTTPD is using port 80 HTTP is basically our link like 27.0.0.1 and FTP server is using port 22, Mercury server port 25, and MySQL server port 3309, 3306. All right, to exit this, just click exit. And if you ever start your Windows, you don't have to go to every. Uh, you don't have to go to control panel every time. You just type in your control panel is just to manage the controls which are working it doesn't have to do anything to start WAMP or something with the exam or something like that so I hope you like it please subscribe and download will be in description subscribe rate comment and like please if you have any doubts regarding this then please comment or personal message me PM me if you want to request a tutorial please go to my website go to contact or message me from your youtube account alright so see ya maybe in next tutorial